can you compare and contrast the sort of mental health emphasis and also mental health of, of the various teams you've been on? Yeah, I think I think a lot of teams nowadays are starting to kind of really focus on that side and realize the importance of it. And, you know, Brewers do a, a great job with that. They do. And, you know, they their organization does a great job of just taking care of their players just on and off the field, just trying to really make everything as, as smooth and, and effortless as possible so they can really focus everything on, on their game and, and make sure they're feeling good. And But I experienced, you know, very similar with, with Toronto and Tampa with, with their their mental health guys. And it, it honestly, it helped me because I feel like players, like we, we understand that side to that we want that. We want that. We want that mindfulness. But I feel like we never been taught to get there in a way it's always just hey just just do it but it's like I'll try to do it but <laughs> so in in Toronto especially for me whether it was once or twice a week just getting with with our mental coach and just kind of running through mindfulness techniques just to kind of clear the mind and allow you to be in the present moment was was really something special to me and I noticed it day and night and getting on the field and and being able to just kind of let the past go don't worry about the future and and really focus on the moment and yeah it's definitely something as a young player in the big leagues is something you struggle with you're playing against the best in the in the world it may not be playing every day you may not be playing well and now you got thoughts are they going to send me down tomorrow I don't know is the next day going to be it it's like Mm -hmm. definitely challenging so having ways to be able to clear your mind and and put yourself in the present moment and just and just go at it the game you worked at your whole life and has it's truly something that's that's special and and that players you know work toward it's just finding ways to to get there for them yeah we, we had a, a, a Mets minor league pitcher on our, on our pod a couple of months ago, Connor O'Neill, who was saying, I, I love the way that he described it. It's sort of the pessimistic view, but baseball is a game of failure. And he was talking about the idea of, you know, the locker room can be a tough place. And like, hey, put a round bat on a round ball is not something easy to do. It is nice to hear that you mentioned, whether it be, you know, the Jays, the Brewers or otherwise, that these these resources are available to players. So us 